you all get what hey tinubu went to bauchi state and they did not allow him to perform imagine that due to an audio malfunction hmm. me that was already sitting down with my popcorn and my coca-cola <laughs> I waiting for the new release from Tinobu, you know. I was expecting Tinobu to drop an album EP, you know, the regular blah blah blue, blah blah, <laughs> broom 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 broom, you know that kind of stuff. That was what I was expecting, but to my disappointment, even Buhari flew all the way from Abuja down to Bauchi all for this rally, and the rally, <clears throat> in a nutshell, let's just say the rally did not happen because. They said due to uh, uh, an audio malfunction, Burari was even unable to give a speech. Tinobu was unable to give a speech. We don't know if the audio malfunction is a cover-up. We don't know. We don't know for a fact. But hmm, if you ask me, I will tell you that there is more to this story. Anyway, before we get right into the details of today's news, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, why are you not subscribed? At this point, you should be subscribed. You are able to watch to this point. So why not just subscribe already? Subscribe, turn on the post notification bell so that you'll be the first person to get notified whenever we upload a new video. Give this video a massive thumbs up so that it gets recommended to other YouTube viewers all across the world. Lastly, leave your comments in the comment section. Without further ado, let's delve right into the details of today's news. Thousands of supporters of the All Progressive Congress, APC, have angrily left the venue of a presidential campaign rally as the party's presidential candidate, Bola Metinobu, could not address them because of an audio malfunction at the Abubakar Tafawa Baliwa Stadium in Bauchi State. The disappointed supporters from various states of the Northeast state started leaving the venue abruptly on Monday, after the address of the Director General of the Presidential Campaign Council, PCC, of our All Progressive Congress Governor Simon Lalong, President Mohamed Buhari, and the presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, as well as the National Chairman of the APC, mounted the podium to speak, but the sound system went off. All efforts to restore the sound system proved abortive. Vanguard reports that President Buhari and Tenobu could no longer address the disappointed crowd who were already on their way out. After waiting for about 10 minutes for the sound to be restored, President Muhammadu Buhari and the chairman of the All Progressive Congress, Abdullah Yadamu, presented a flag to the gubernatorial candidate of the APC in Bauchi State, Sadiq Baba Abubakar, before filing out to board their already waiting convoy. Efforts to get a reaction from officials of the party were not successful at press time as no official was willing to talk. You all remember what uh, that woman, the Director General for the Campaign Committee for Tinobu said that at uh, the Yola rally, they were, mm -hmm. they, 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 they had to tell someone to collect the mic from Tinobu just to save their faces, just to save themselves from embarrassment. I am feeling like I have the sense that this might be one of those, those situations where, you know, they were <laughs> Tinubu probably was incapacitated or you know was just down at the moment you know how dementia works like it might just be in his feelings and they they're like what can we do what can we do how are we going to allow him talk in this state let's just look for one you know excuse or the other just to you know cover just to you know save our face and you know avoid embarrassment and avoid those ending up in the news the next morning you get what i'm saying i feel that 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 must have been what happened because how can a whole president buhario he left abuja to bauchi all for the sake of this rally just for this rally and then you know he got to abuja he was even unable to mount the podium to talk to the people of bauchi state he was not even able you know to say anything in bauchi state you can imagine that and even Tinubu himself at least we all know that it's not as if 
during the rallies that these are political parties do is not as if they present very reasonable manifesto or they pre they have a very reasonable speech that they read out during the rally of how they are going to change the country or of how they are going to make the, the economic situation of a country get better or of how they are going to you know ha uh, make people's lives get better when they get into office we all know that most of them do not do this you know they dance 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 and dance and just you know insult other political parties and then that's it but notwithstanding you know <laughs> this is a rally for crying out loud and you know to say that because of an audio malfunction that the presidential candidate is unable to address people i feel that <clears throat> Something is just not clicking, like it's just not sounding right to me. It's just not sounding right because I don't even know how else to explain it. Um it's just it's just <laughs> it's just not sounding right to me because how? Like I know that they must have known that, you know, the president, if not for Tinobu's sake, let's just say they must have known that the president is coming, the president is going to be at this rally. So you, you would think that uh, preparations and everything would be top-notch, like they would, they would, there would be adequate preparations towards the coming of a president to this rally and people will be on their toes to make sure that things work. Although, on the other hand, technical difficulties, technical um, uh, malfunctions such as this do happen in our cause, like it's not something that is that that doesn't happen it is something that happens but notwithstanding these people should have put everything in order they, they, they should know that the president is coming right so and you would expect that okay let's just assume that they they try their best and you know unforeseen circumstances happen they did not plan for this to happen and then it happened five ten minutes the the audio malfunction still wasn't sorted and even after that, after ten minutes, Adamu even presented the flag to the to the governorship candidate of the state, and still yet this audio mark function wasn't rectified. Hmm. APC. Hmm, 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 hmm. You guys, tell me something. What is happening? Let me know what you all think in the comment section because this is just my opinion. You guys know I don't know much. I'm just keeping it real. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.